Hello everyone, it's Doc here and today we are doing an exciting, at least I think, exciting video for you. Um, so I've been scrolling around on AliExpress lately because I've just been looking for various blind boxes and figures. I really love doing blind box unboxings and I enjoy collecting them as well. So I wanted to expand my horizons and I love different figures from different countries, especially Japan and Asia in general. Um, these specific figures are from China, I believe. I, I believe they're all from China. Uh, I'll correct myself if I'm wrong, but uh, some I do not know the name of, to be perfectly honest. However, I found these all on AliExpress. A lot of them, a lot of the blind box figures I found seem to be Pop Mart. Uh, Laura was very popular. We do have some Lauras over here. We have four boxes to be exact. Uh, I found some Irene's too. I wanted to try unboxing those. That series looked pretty cool. So I don't, I can't read um, Chinese characters or I, or I forget what you call it. I believe it's Chinese characters cannot read them so I will have to go and try and find the listing however some of the listings don't actually say what it is if that makes sense so I'm not sure <laughs> but I can definitely link you uh, the link will be into the description if you're interested it's not affiliated or anything like that um, just putting that out there I it's just so you can find it if you're interested that's all it'll be for uh, yeah, so let's get right to it. Um, some of these are smushed. <laughs> like, I think this is the worst one. Um, this Irene's pretty bad. This mystery, I don't know what this is called because I can't read it, but it looks so cool. I wanted to get it. Um, yeah, so we're going to try one of those. That one was kind of expensive too. Just going to add. Um, yeah, so some of them are smushed. It is not the vendor's fault. Pretty much all of them were nicely wrapped in a box. Oh my god, one even came with these cute little cat figures. Uh, before I keep going, I'm just, let's just look at these real quick. Look at this cute little calico cat. Oh my gosh, and this one's a gray, and oh my gosh, it's got a mustache on it. Oh, and you can turn the head craziness. Can you turn the tail too? No. Anyways, oh my gosh, they're so cute. Uh, yeah, I got these as a freebie. I definitely didn't order them, so that was cool. Uh, the seller, I believe it was the same that I got these with. I think it's because this was a bigger order. That was probably at least, at least 60, 80 bucks right there. Um, these figures aren't really cheap. They're like at least 20 bucks each, um, but I think they're meant to be like art style figures. They're not meant to be like a toy or anything like that. It's like an art thing, kind of like a sculpture, if you will. Well, that's the mentality I have with it, at least when it comes to prices. These are like art pieces, not really meant to be toys. Um, so we will look at quality with that too. It's my first time unboxing these kind of art style figures. So anyways, I just wanted to let you know that it was not the vendor's fault. It came in, the box looked pretty secure. The uh, mail delivery person kind of, they really tried to shove it in the mailbox, like two boxes at once. <laughs> but to be fair, it was raining out, so I appreciate their thought. But <laughs> yeah, we, we, have, we have a few casualties. Hopefully the figures are okay, but we will see. Um, yeah, so anyways, let's get right to it. Okay, so first up we have this, I believe it's Oh, it says right here, Spring Festival. So I'm not sure what the, oh, Sword and Fairy. There it is, Sword and Fairy. It is the Chinese traditional festival. It says down here, a Spring Festival. Uh, yeah, so here's the characters that you could get. Really, really pretty. I like this one a lot. I like this one. Um, that dress kind of reminds me of something. Uh, mystery figure, that one's cool. This one, she's really cute as well. So let's just, let's see who we get. The funnest part of these blind boxes. Whoa, what is this? Is it gonna be a spoiler card? Uh, I'll 
I'll see what it is after. What, what the heck is this? Ooh, sticky. Don't like. I'm sure there was a reason that's there that I'm not aware of. Let's open you up. So this is, oh my gosh, sticky. It is sticky. Uh, so this is a part of Pop Mart. I guess it's like a company. Who did we get? Oh, we got one of the ones I wanted, I believe. Uh, oh, I think her accessory. Oh, there's a stand. Okay, so part of it is a stand. Then what the heck is this? Okay, so we got our scissors. And oh my gosh, what the heck's going on there? There's a little stand. And then this little tiny thing. I don't know if you can see it. I think it's like supposed to be a piece of snow or what the heck is that supposed to be? Oh, I know what it is. It's like those little like um, pattern things. Gosh, I don't know the name of it. Uh, like it's a, oh yeah, good. I'm glad I didn't look at it. This is like the little card. Uh, yeah, I think it, it might be food, but I think it's, no, it's supposed to be um, like one of those, oh, I don't know what it's called, but it's like a fabric. Tapestry? No, not tapestry, but along the same lines. Just think of that. Oh, her hair is wrapped. Oh, look at that. Look at this little, like, detail on the, the gradients. Oh, it's up here, too. That's so cool. Oh, my gosh. That's annoying, though. I wish it would, like, lock in place. Oh, it does. It does lock in place. So there's these two little... I don't know if you'd be able to see that because my camera's not being very cooperative right now. There is two little holes, um, and I don't know if you can see, but there's two, two little like pegs kind of sticking out. Let's see if we can, oh my gosh. You would not believe what just happened to me. I just broke her. It's like a remove oh, guys I'm so upset I broke her arm off trying to get it on there was no oh my gosh okay yeah it's not one of those situations where it's like removable it's not supposed to be removed well then why the heck did they make it so hard to okay let's just pre <laughs> let's just pretend that her arm is I'm gonna have to hot glue this crazy Oh my gosh, I don't even have a hot glue gun. I'm gonna have to borrow my brother's. I'm incredibly sad. She is so cute too. I wanted to do a, uh, like, looper, because it's supposed to, like, click. So I was trying to get it to, like, this. Oh my gosh. Stand is cool. It's just like, um,. It's like little pegs you just stick their feet in. That's all and swell and dandy and cool. However, her arm fell off. She's currently only got one of those. Um, it's, it's, I, oh. Okay. And then this is her card. On the back, it's, oh, it's got a QR code. I'll check that out and let you know if it's anything interesting. Okay, so while we're at it, while we got this thing spinning, we may as well show the two little, oh. So these are our little freebies that we got from the same seller that had the bunch of Loras that I suppose we will unbox now because honestly, I am the most interested to see them. Okay, so continuing on with the theme of broken boxes. Oh, come on. Or not broken boxes, but messed up boxes. Let's see. This is the Laura Sweet Monsters. Um, is there anything specific? It says Toy City X Laura Girl. There's a lot of these Toy City Laura figures, and they're all so interesting, in my opinion. Um, so there's a lot in this series. I really like the gummy bear one. I like the fox one a lot. 
and they're all just so cute. I believe the the secret uh, ones are really cool as well. I forget what they are. It shows on the site, but I just, I can't remember for the life of me. Oh, this is a cool like rose gold. We'll, we won't look at the card yet because I'm pretty sure that's gonna tell us who it is. And I like surprises. So who are you? Get it all in one go. Oh, we got the clown. Oh, cute. Look at the little like whipped cream little swirlies and the sprinkle. Oh, I don't think this is the clown. I don't think this is the clown. Hold on a second, we got the card. Let's take out the card. Oh, this is so cool. It's like a little, um, not movie ticket, but like a theme park ticket. Oh, that is so cool. So this one's Sweet Monsters. Does this Marshmallow Snow Monster. That is so freaking cool. Um, we'll have to check out the QR codes in a second when we're done. Um, so yeah, so far we get these two figures. I really like the Laura like presentation on there. A little thingy my bobbers. Um, so I love the design on these little figures. I also, come on now, you can focus. Okay, I also really, really like their eyes. Um, just the design overall is cute. Look at the little, like, it's like a little teddy bear. Can we zoom in? Like a little teddy bear and look at the eyes and like the star and the eyes and the color is just gorgeous. The little pouty lips and the color, uh, the, the little whipped cream dollops swirlies and oh my oh this is like suede almost it's like a, a for oh come on now i'm so sorry it is my camera's being a jerk um this dress is really cute you got blushing at the knees that's so adorable and the little boots um so the stand uh, here is the stand. It's the same type as that sword and fairy doll. Oh, and it comes with a little stick. I really hope I don't break her arm off. That was absolutely ridiculous. That was, I mean, I know I've got um, pretty poopy luck, but honestly, that is so like me to break the arm off. Oh, that figure was expensive too. I think it was at least $20. Uh, so we got the Laura Sweet Monster little stand. Oh, so it isn't hollow. It's got a little... That's cool. And then we got our little snow thing. Oh my god, there is a peg too. I better not try to try too hard with this one either. Oh my gosh, no. My enemy. I don't know if you can see. Come on, you can focus. You can do it. Yeah, so there's a little peg there is kind of like the same with the sword and fairy one except that one broke like I broke her arm off trying to that might have been a user error that really could have been my luck I died I can't I can't tell ya okay it's probably gonna focus weird when I try to do it oh my gosh I got it whoa what a oh my but let's take a look at this gal going around or got little snow teddy bear <laughs> love it my camera died but now we're back into business so let's keep going on with the let's keep going on with the sweet monster so let's see who we got this time oh ew Another one of those packets. Here we go. I really think this is a cool color. I know this is irrelevant, but this is like a cool little tin foil thing. Okay, so I got the accessories. Don't want to look at it yet. And now the, oh, we got the one I wanted. Oh my gosh. It's not the rarer one, because I think there's like a dark one you can get, but oh my gosh, I wanted her so much. I love gummy bears and the colors are just so cool. Oh my gosh, her little boots are, transparent oh my gosh this is gonna be one of the coolest figures 
that I have so far. Look at the little lime green eyebrows and the gummy bears are like struggling to stay on and the gradient hair. They're really doing the gradient hair well in these figures. Like the colors are just so cool. I love the transparent. Got a little gummy bear bag and then this little bow. I want to see, let me see close up. Oh, it's a star in her eyes. So this is the figure we got. Oh my gosh, got a little cute tail too. Okay, now let's unbox accessories, which is, I don't know what the heck these are. Oh, I think those are gloves. Oh, this has to be the coolest little line. It definitely was my favorite. That's why I got three. Just seeing it online, it was my favorite out of all the lower ones. So I had decided to get three. And if you get like, there's like a deal if you get two or you get three and then you could get the whole one too and it'd be a little cheaper than buying them individually, but it's still a lot of money. Um, Cause these, these figures aren't really cheap, but also you can get free shipping if you buy it on some of the stores there. So how the heck am I gonna break an arm trying to do this again? <sighs> okay, hold on. Okay, you know me, I definitely had them on the wrong hand. So they're actually pretty easy to get on when you have them on the right hand because these, you know, have little thumbs. So if you put it on the wrong hand, then it's uh, not gonna work. These are really cool. Love this accessory. Love this figure so much. Let's take a closer look at her on the little merry-go-round mirror we have here. She is so freaking cool. Okay, and let's do the last sweet monster unboxing. I wonder if it'll be a limited edition one. Probably not, because I do not that have that kind of luck. <laughs> uh, it's always fun to see anyways, right? That's what I love about blind unboxings. And I also really like these ones where they have like the super rares. It's just really interesting to see and wonder if we'll get the right one. Now, I of course forgot to... Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. I want to show you her little tag. This I'm such a mess, guys. I know which one I got because I looked in the wrong box. Okay, so it's not going to be a surprise for this current one. But here is the Gummy Bears little ticket, carnival ticket thing. So it's Yummy Gummy Bears. Really cool. Again, we have to check that out after. Uh, okay, so we do know which one we're going to get. Well, I do, but... For you guys, it will be a mystery because I don't know if you just heard me, but I accidentally took the wrong tag trying to show the gummy bear one. <laughs> but we got the little werewolf. Oh, she is so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's absolutely hilarious. I think she's one of the mystery ones. I think she's one of the secret ones. Okay, where, where'd her little tag go? I have to investigate. It is. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's hilarious. That is so like me to say that I never get lucky and then the one time I ever get lucky is after saying I don't get lucky. That is so me. Okay, so we got one of the secret ones and this is the Picnic Werewolf. And so I guess the secret have these little, uh, it's like, iridescent or what would you call that? I'd, I'd say iridescent. Um, this is the normal one and this is the secret one. Little tickets. So that is so cool. <laughs> and it's so, so like me. You don't even understand the picnic basket. Look guys, okay, so this is her picnic basket and this is her little baguette. Ah, oh, look at that. Adorable, cool figure. I love her little attitude too. Look at the little like uh, drowsy eyes, I guess you call it. And she's got little dots under her eyes and little pouty lips. She's got little blushing on her nose and her cheeks. And again, I think at the knee, okay, not at this one's knees, but she does have blushing at her little hands. I don't know if you can see it. I realize I don't have the light on. Um, a little blushing at the hands and the cheek. Uh, there is, an iridescent little bow and her 
This is an interesting material. I don't know how to describe this, but I guess it's kind of rubbery, but not really. I don't know how to describe it, honestly. It's just so cute. She's really cute, but if I'm being perfectly honest, her design out of all the designs I've seen online for the secrets doesn't seem that extravagant for it being a secret. Not that I'm complaining because, you know, one secret is better than no secret. Um, could you imagine I break the arm on this one? That would be hilariously devastating. Picnic Werewolf. Awesome. Let's try an Irene. Let's try this beat up one. Okay, so here's the ones that we can get. Now these seem to be a little less detailed, but I could be wrong. I want to, um, is there any English writing? There's no English writing. Okay, I'll try to look up the link I bought it on to see the translation for this. All I know is it's Irene. Oh, wait, who are you supposed to be? Because I don't think they come with a card, these ones. It's a good thing I can read Chinese characters. <laughs> well, this is this one so we didn't get the secret one but that's totally fine she is cute and sassy um maybe it's like myth myth something because this is like the little demon mask i believe it's called oh look at the cape okay that's cool uh the little flames look at the gradient they have really cool gradients going on and oh it's even iridescent the cape is iridescent that's really cool um, got a little like stitch on the leg and the little transparent gradient. They have such good gradients on these um, art figures. That's so cool. A uh, little like carnival type outfit. I could be wrong, but that's what it looks like to me. And like this little tear almost like at a carnival. I think, I don't know, I could be totally wrong. These kind of look like goat ears as well. Um, really cool figure. I wish I knew the name. I will go back and check. Oh, wait a minute. There should be a stanch in there. Or I guess, oh, guys, I found the card. It was hiding. So, oh, it says fire. That's the only one I can read. Maybe this is like an elemental one. Um, that's the only thing I can read. It's in English. But this is her card. Really cool. I need to like have a little card binder for these figures because I definitely want to collect more and unbox more of these. And it seems like there's always new releases. So all kinds of fun. The fun continues. Now, the only thing I don't like is she does not stand. I do not see a stand that comes with this in my pile of junk over here. Um, so this is very unfortunate. She does not stand and her cape prevents her from standing and I do not want to break it. Oh my gosh. She does this. <laughs> she kind of stands. If I turn this on, is this going to like, look, she's doing the Michael Jackson lean. <laughs> yeah. So I guess she kind of stands. I guess it's kind of menacing, is it not? Like, ooh, I'm about to get you. Um, anyways, I'm not funny. <laughs> okay, so this is this doll. This is the fire element, I believe. Here we go. This is our last Irene. In the process, I accidentally saw the card for this one. But again, I like surprises. I like seeing the figure pulled out first. I don't like seeing the card first. But at least you guys, it will be a surprise. So we have, is this a rare? No. No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, I can't be that lucky. That's just not going to happen. Okay. So we got her, this, it does come, they do come with a stand. So that is nice. Um, I wonder if it actually works well though. This kind of seems like a little pathetic stand, if you ask me. Not trying to be mean, but... <laughs> How much leaning? There is some lean going on, um, but I think that's supposed to be there. 
and you got oh you got like gems in her hair and like this little box hat thing and her cape is iridescent as well really cute now what is she supposed to be because i have her card here oh charm she does kind of seem like a charmy character uh yeah so that's her card I'll leave this one to last because I'm the most intrigued about this figure. Um, I don't know. I might get disappointed because it, I don't know. There's not a lot of information in the listing. Anyways, let's look at this Laura Chinese style figures. Um, so here's the ones that you can get. I'm really interested. I think there's a fox one. I like the bunny one too. Where's the fox one? Maybe there's not a fox one. It might possibly be the secret. Probably not. I thought that said golden. Oh, it is the golden retriever. Who is it? Phoenix. I'm going to guess Phoenix. Is this actually the Phoenix? I think this might be the Phoenix. <laughs> oh, this is the Pegasus. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so here is her card. This is a really cool one. I like the um, the sweets ones better. That was really cool. Okay, so she does come with a little whip. Uh, you can hold in her hand and hopefully not rip her arm off like I did to the other one. So, okay, that was pretty easy. And then I like the stands for the lower ones because um, it's just like little pegs you put in their feet and it fits Re or it stays really well. I say that as I have much difficulty getting her on, seriously. See her in all her glory. Oh, I like her hair actually. Really cool the way it like flips around and then her little tail and oh, look at the iridescent colors. That is so cool. Her little boots are cute and her little um Chinese style dress. Let's just stop this. I love the little accessory at the her little ponytail too. I really like their eyebrows and how expressive their faces are and like there's a lot of blushing going on. There's blushing at her knees and her hands and her ears and her nose as well. So cute. Really love the hair and the colors going on. Fits the theme very well of like Pegasus our final and for me it was the piece de resistance because i don't know it's just so intriguing to me now the box is beat up a little bit i hope there's not a stand missing in this one so there's a secret you can get i love that there's secrets you can get in these boxes it's just so much fun um it doesn't really show that well the figures in my opinion but all of them look so cool like i'd be happy getting any of them Okay, now is it going to be blind boxed? It wasn't going to be blind boxed. I just, wow, she is so cute. Okay, I know I was um, beating it up for not being blind boxed, but oh my gosh, look how cute this figure is. Look at her face. Oh my gosh, did not disappoint. Like, I'm not going to lie, the like promo photos or whatnot on the aliexpress seller page looked like kind of sketchy like it didn't really show much if i'm being completely honest but oh my gosh look how beautiful really really cute look at this okay so pick pickaboo is it Prekaboo? I, I don't know. There's little like two little Shivas cuddling though. That's so cute. Okay, I really like her. I like her dress as well. Wow, really cool. Um, she comes with a card. So from my experience out of this run is they all come with cards. Well, they're supposed to be like art figures, right? From my understanding. Really cool. Unfortunate that I can't read the writing. I'm not sure. I don't really trust translating apps, but I really want to know what this means. So maybe I'll have to investigate. Really, really pretty. Look how cute. 
and her eyes have like little flowers in them like she's a little smaller scale like her head is is smaller scale to let's say Laura oh my gosh drop the whip um but so so cute glad and kind of like weighted pretty heavy this is her and her cards I wish I'd know what her name was maybe I can research and find it I feel like it's gonna be a bit of a a goose chase though. 